So welcome to Lego haul number three. Uh, as you can see from the background, I got the uh, cargo truck from one of my previous hauls actually built. Um, so we're using that as a little backdrop for the haul today. Um, start off with a couple of non-Lego items uh, related to um, being able to take videos. I went into Walmart and they happened to have some camera stuff on sale. Um, so one of the things that I bought was a camera light and you can't actually see it um, right now because it's on the top of my camera but what you can see is uh, that it was originally marked down to $29 and I wound up paying $12 for it um, but it says Sunpack high speed camera light um, and just so you can see the difference if I turn it off you can see um, how the, there's just not nearly as much light as there is when I turn it on um, also may need to be doing some adjusting to the white balance on the camera, but I uh, do get a lot more light with that on there. I also uh, found a filter set on clearance for $8. It's got a UV filter and a polarizer in it, so I uh, went ahead and got those um, for the camera to help out with making the videos. Now, on to the fun stuff, the actual uh, LEGO stuff. I went into TJ Maxx, uh, and normally my TJ Maxx does not have any Lego stuff whatsoever. Uh, they did happen to have a couple of items on clearance this time. They had these um, mini Lego boxes, and i uh, not quite sure what's going on with the camera why I won't focus, but... This is Lego box. It says mini box 8, probably because it's got 8 studs on the top of it. Um, but it's basically like a larger 2x4 brick. Um, they had two of these, and um, they were both this light pink color. Uh, they had them on clearance for $2. Uh, not entirely sure what the original price of them was. Um, they're not actual Lego bricks. In fact, the other one um, I was actually just um, didn't have that cardboard wrapper on it. just had a zip tie holding it together. So I went ahead and took the zip tie off so you could see what it is. But you can see there's no opening on the bottom. They're not really uh, stackable. But it's just a little container that you put things in. Um, I thought they were kind of cute, and they did have um, two of them marked down to two dollars a piece. So they'll make good. Just knocked the little dog off. They're gonna. Um, those will make good uh, props for something else that I decide to work on, probably. Um, if not, they're always good little containers to keep things in and hide things in. Uh, at the same Walmart where I found the camera equipment, they also had um, a few Lego things on sale. They had a lot of castle sets on clearance, but you could tell that somebody had opened them and more than likely taken a whole bunch of parts out of them, so I didn't even attempt to purchase those, but, sorry. Um, they did have a couple of LEGO Star Wars watches on sale, and you can tell this one was clearance for $3, and this is the uh, Yoda watch. Let me see if I can get that to uh, printing on the box to uh, focus in, but um, and you can see it comes with the Yoda minifigure. So I don't, I'm not really too excited about the watch itself, but uh, the fact the Yo the Yoda minifigure itself, I thought for three bucks was a pretty good deal. So I wound up picking that up, and then they also happened to have uh, the old style Clone Wars Anakin Skywalker uh, Star Wars watch. And I don't know if you can see the price on this one, but this one was marked down to five dollars. And um, so I went ahead and picked that one up too. Uh, $5 for that minifigure wasn't too bad of a deal either, I didn't think. So um, So we wound up getting two of those. And then there's only two more things left in this haul. Uh, Target had a buy one, 40 per get one 40% off sale on their Lego Star Wars things. And um, so I did pick up a couple. I did pick up two sets, uh, trying to save my money for some non-Lego things completely unrelated to Lego. So. Um, I just got two of the 75035 Kashyyyk Troopers uh, Battle Packs, and I'll zoom the camera out here a little bit so that you can see the whole box. Do some adjusting here. Um, but but I wound up getting two of those um, so that I could get one 40% off, um, and I'm probably going to... Uh, build one and use the uh, minifigure parts for some other minifigures that I want to build uh, later on, but um, 
four minifigures for the first one was uh, $12.99 and then the second one was like $7 or something like that. So it was a pretty good deal to get eight minifigures plus it has a few other pieces to build that, that other piece that comes with it. Uh, this is a newer one. I may or may not do a review on it. Um, it's a newer set but it's also uh, one that a lot of people already have and it is a battle pack. Um, so it's, it's not quite as exciting as some of the other sets. But that's all for this LEGO haul. Um, look forward to seeing you in the next video.